What's up, YouTube? This is your boy Darklight coming to you with another movie review. And today is all. This movie, I gotta give two thumbs up. I'm gonna go ahead and get my rating now on it because I give this movie a 4.5 out of 5. This was a good movie. There's another movie that's gonna probably go under the radar, just like Crawl. But I loved it. I got a chance to see it the other day, and I was, ooh, I had so many range of emotions in this movie. Um, I, this is gonna be a non spoiler. Just gonna talk about, it, give a little insight on it. Um, also, before I get started into this movie, movie review. Uh, I just want to make a big, big apology to, um, Samara Wheaton. Because when I first seen the trailer for this, I thought she was Margaret Robbie. Yeah, Harley Quinn, Suicide Squad, y'all know her. <laughs> yeah, I thought that was her. They look just... Or like it could possibly be twin sisters from long, long lost parents, you know, long lost relatives or whatever you want to call it, because they so alike, so much alike. So I just want to apologize to Samara Weaving. Sorry, 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 sorry. But it did, it made me even more interested to see. Like I said, this movie has pushed out a good range of emotions because it works as a good horror movie good thriller um, good suspense to see what this character would do would this character survive um, and I want to say one other thing Mm, nah, I don't think it probably deal with it. And it's pretty much probably also a little bit of a mystery. Nah, you know what? No, it won't. No, it's not. No, it's not. Thriller, horror, suspense, sound, sound by right. Um, but yeah, your main star would be Samara Weaver, name who's her character, Grace. Basically, she's getting married into a fridge into a rich family and this family became rich through some games like uh, old card games and board games and you know it went through the years and generations and this this rich family also this rich family those actors that's part of this family they are great. They give you this. They give you some good range. You know, um, they help out a little bit more with the emotions in this. They gave you fear. They gave you laughter. They gave you. Uh, it made you angry. And it wasn't like that. This movie is not like. Uh, strangers that pray at night. It's not like these people are really trying to kill anybody they just have a reason to do it and they're dumb enough to be to follow through yes dumb um it actually shows more about rich people i should say you know if you're born into a rich family how that goes and it also shows another range of if you're not rich and you were brought into this family if you were from a poor side of the family or poor side of the world and you brought into a rich family, how that goes. Um this there's this movie just great. Um uh, they also give you a good amount of hmm good amount of can't figure find what I was looking for. I lost it just that quick. I'm sorry, I lost it. But um, 
this movie also shows pretty much shows you the death of how the death of how a human mind how far a human would go basically that's that's what I was trying to figure out this will actually show you how far human beings will go for anything because uh, the main character of the story Grace she showed she was pretty much the prey in this and she it shows you how far you put you can push someone before they just snaps or how much they will fight for survival. And this is, I mean, this is, it was wonderful. It wasn't like no horror movie where some guy's trying to hunt somebody down and somehow he's, they never explain he's in the army or something, but he's doing military stuff. He's doing monstrous thing. It's just a normal human being. That's just crazy in the Now, this show that you push a person too far into that corner, he gonna come out sooner or later. He or she is coming out fighting for survival. And this is one good movie that show that showed some great aspects of that. It's pretty much like that old saying about the if you push a dog too far, I mean if you force a dog too far in the corner, he's gonna come out biting. He's gonna come out. He's gonna be throwing them one two punches with his mouth. But these people, whoever the director is, the writer, they did a wonderful job with this movie. I mean, wonderful. I was shocked. Like I said, it, it was interesting to see. Then there was a little bit of a twist in it. A somewhat twist. Because I thought it was majority about this family. Just trying to kill some one per, one single person, but there's a like I said, there's a reason why they have to do it. It ain't like they just doing it because it's fun to do. It's a, it's a twist of a reason why they have to. That that had, had got me more interested in this movie. Um, like I said, the whole cast of this family, they were great. They were awesome. Uh, pretty much, uh, you have the actors, Samara Reeman, which I say multiple, quadruple times probably now. She's pretty much the, uh, young woman who just got married into a fam into a rich family, and she's pretty much have to survive, basically. Uh, you have Adam Brody, Mark O'Brien, Henry Cesarni. Andy McDowell, Melanie Scrofano, Christian Broom, Nikki Guadani, Elise Levesque, John Ralston, Liam Madonna, and Ethan Tover. Yes. And Celine Tsai and Daniela Barbosa. That's the whole cast in this movie. They basically sent around. Everything is in this one big old mansion. It's sad. There's one big old house. And everything is sent around around this family. It's wonderful. I, if I had y'all to go see it, go and support this movie. Let's go ahead and get, I would love to see another one like it. But please, y'all go and support this movie. It was great. Like I said, it was great. You won't be disappointed. Like I said, you might have your questions here and there but I guarantee you in this movie they will answer some of those for you well probably a big majority of them, they're going to answer it this movie isn't long it's about a good hour and 30 minutes maybe yeah a good hour and 35 minutes and from the IMDB page they say this more of a comedy horror and mis and I was just and I just said mystery, um, but I mean it work it works in so much it could be suspense because you wouldn't know what's going once this character she's doing all this hiding if she gets caught what's going to happen? Uh, because there's a couple of times where you be thinking oh, well she's dead nah 
she manages to escape because of the kindness of their of someone's heart, or somebody just didn't like what they were doing, basically. Uh, but like I said, I don't. This is I meant to make this a non-spoiler, so I know I spoil a few things in it. But I guarantee, you, if you see this movie, there's gonna be a lot more to what I see. And I mean, a lot more for a short movie. It's a lot more. Uh, yes, it is. Like it said in the MDB, it's comedy. Yes, there are some funny moments. And I mean funny. When I was watching, I had some moments where I just laughed out loud. Literally just sitting back. I'm, I'm telling you, there's some funny good little jokes and little things in here. Little scenes in here that you would actually just start dying laughing. Um... But yeah, this gives you a good range of emotions. Fear, laughter, uh, happiness, uh, uh, a little bit of suspense, anger. And so yeah. But if y'all... So, if y'all like this video, y'all please give it a thumbs up. Hit that thumb button down there you know down below you know subscribe to the channel if you want to become part of the angels and learn and just you know because i'm gonna do more and more movie reviews um there's not a lot of new movies out there that i've got a chance to see uh, i got a movie review for the curse of lorana coming up even some anime stuff so but yeah so, this is Dark Light. See, I, I also, one other thing. If y'all want to catch me, talk, talk to me down in the comments, y'all can. Sure. Y'all can hit me up on Twitter. Your choice. So, you know, we can all be one big happy family. But yeah, this is Dark Light. I'll catch y'all in another video. But cheerio.